I could take it back all the way to when I was eight years old, when I would make up songs with my neighbor. And that was like our favorite game, was to make up songs and to sing, and like at the top of our lungs. <laughs> When I was 15 years old, that's when I started writing music and songs. I felt like I was going through so much teen angst, growing up, high school, and I needed that like outlet for expression. I wasn't very athletic <laughs> or um, social, so just like being alone in my room playing music was my way to decompress and to like kind of understand myself. I feel like I'm both Mexican and American, 50-50. Um, and the album really captures that because the songs are in English and in Spanish. And I sing about my childhood growing up in Mexico and also growing up here as I got older. It's called Galaxia de Emociones. I came up with the name at the start of the pandemic when I started going to therapy and diving into like all the emotions I was feeling that I wasn't used to feeling before, like fear, anxiety through the roof, and lots of doubt. The song Natural was also one of the ones that like helped really shape the album. It says, No tiene caso controlar lo que viene natural con el miedo a fracasar no se puede avanzar. Which means if you're always fearful of taking action, you're never gonna get anywhere. And that's how I was feeling at the time when I wrote it. Because I was putting like barriers on myself, just like, oh, my music has to be a certain genre or in a certain language, um, or I have to have a certain look to appeal to like a wider audience. But then I, I just like convinced myself that that's not, that's all a lie. Like the best thing I can do is just to be myself. Yeah, it's kind of random. Sometimes they come in English, sometimes in Spanish. Um, and I always have to make sure that I'm translating correctly. <laughs> Like we saw drones in the sky and I was like, how do you say drones in Spanish? Um, and then I, I constantly have to like translate inside my brain. Since I speak in Spanglish and I think in Spanglish, it comes easy to me to write music in Spanglish too. like Wicked, Spring Awakening, Hairspray, just Broadway musicals. I feel like I kind of took a lot of that and put it into my own music. I like for it to be a little theatrical and I love that aspect of like performing. I feel like I'm in a musical or in a play playing a character, but it's, it's me <laughs> and I'm telling my own story. I 
really made it a point to be vulnerable and to just be myself. And I hope people get to see that. I kind of want people to feel like they're understood and they're not alone. And I want them to feel happy. Like that's the most important, I think, for me is for people to feel happiness when they listen.